Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Acer Nitro V15, AN V15, 51. If you want to have a look at the internals, you have to undo 11 Phillips head screws. Then you can pop the bottom plate with a plastic tool starting from one of the top two corners. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. The battery isn't fixed to the chassis with screws because there is a dedicated socket for it on the inside of the bottom panel that is keeping the unit in place. The battery is a 57 watt hour model. If you want to remove it, just pull out the connector from the main board and you can lift it away from the base safely. The capacity is enough for 7 hours and 42 minutes of web browsing, or 6 hours and 40 minutes of video playback. Not bad considering the Thirsty H-Series CPU and the small battery capacity. The two SODOMs fit up to 32 gigabytes of DDR5, 5200 megahertz RAM in dual channel mode. The RAM stick is additionally cooled by a thermal pad. For storage, you can rely on two M.2 slots, one for Gen 4 and one for Gen 3 SSDs. The cooling looks good for such a device. It comprises two fans, three heat pipes, one large top-mounted heatsink, a smaller one on the left, as well as two heat spreaders. 